Hi there, my name is Lawrence and in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix USB ports that aren't working on your Windows 10 or 11 computer. Sometimes USB ports stop working when there are hardware or driver changes on your computer. In this video I'm going to cover two different steps that should fix the issues you're experiencing with your USB ports. To get started, go into the Windows Start Bar and type in Device Manager and click on the Device Manager search result. Once the Device Manager application opens up, scroll down the page and click on the arrow next to the Universal Serial Bus Controllers section to open it up. Now right click on all of your USB controllers one by one and click on the Properties option. And from the Properties dialog window, click on the Power Management tab and turn off the Allow the computer to turn off this device to save power checkbox. Now for the next step, right click on the first USB 3.1 extensible host controller port and click on the uninstall device option. Now this USB port won't work until you restart your computer. If you're not using a laptop that has a touchpad and you're using a desktop PC with a mouse and keyboard plugged in, then you'll want to restart your PC at this point and then keep uninstalling each USB port and then restarting Windows. This way, you'll always have at least one USB port available to plug in your keyboard or mouse. Once you've performed all of these steps and restarted your PC, the USB ports should now be working. And it's as easy as that. Fixing a USB port that isn't working is a fairly simple task to perform. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, then please subscribe.